and we're back. I'm gonna show you how to get Element 3D on Mac OS. Uh, I don't even know what version I'm running. Sonom Sonoma 14.6. So that's at least what it works for. All right. Uh, y'all can skip this, but I'm probably gonna make a bunch more of these for all the main plugins. Uh, cause I come from like the 2016 era. It was way easier to crack all of this shit, and it took me so fucking long to figure out how to do it on these newer mechs. Um, and I don't want y'all going through that. So, I have this open right here, just to show that I do not have any video copilot shit, and I'm not fucking with y'all. Alright, bet. So, what are we gonna do? We're gonna close After Effects, and you're gonna download this file. If I put it in a driver, Mega, I don't know which one yet. You're gonna open it, all right? And we got the installer and then the license file patcher. So when you try to open this, um, oh shit. When you try to open this, it's not gonna work. It's gonna tell you that it's damaged. How do we fix this? You go to terminal, bet, and then you wanna type in zatter dash CR space. And then you want to drag both of these um, to your desktop. If you don't drag it to your desktop, it's not gonna work. Oh shit! And then drag it in there. Click enter. And you don't need to know why that works, but um, just know that it does. And then you're gonna right click. Okay, you're gonna right click and open this. And it's probably not gonna work the first time. Just do it again. Open. So now we're gonna be at the wizard, right? Let's go. So you're gonna agree, and then you can do a custom path, because I have 2025, and I don't have either of these, or you can do both. Um, it doesn't really matter. And then user documents, type in your password, and let's go, mission success. Finish it, and then just run this patch real quick. Oh my god, you can't open it, because you're going to right click to open it, open, go through the motions, install for all, and then don't worry about this, in the license file, it's it's just a bunch of bullshit, alright, it's only a kilobyte, um, and I'm not saying that just to say that, you're saying that so you don't get sussed out, alright, like these files are super small anyway, you're going to install it, it's going to overwrite that, and then boom, let's go. So, I think for most people, that will work, um, but for me, because I already had it, I uninstalled it for this, for this tutorial. So, when I open it up, uh, After Effects, uh, let's look in the comp, uh, I'm not going to see it. Yo, what the fuck? So, that's because there's no file in your application, oh shit, in your applications to... You know, for it to write to. So you can see it made these folders for 2020 and 2024, um, but it never wrote to 2025. And that's probably because I was too lazy to do the custom file. But if you don't want to do that, or you forgot, you're just going to head into one of these, take this, copy it, it just has the plugin inside of it. Then go back to your actual After Effects folder, plugins, and then just paste that bitch in there. I'm putting your password. I bet. So now when you open up After Effects, when you open up After Effects, blah, 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 make a new thing. Holy shit, we have Video Copilot. So, um, I'm just gonna make a new solid, add it to it, because that's how you use it. And you see there's no red X or anything, like, we're fine. Um, and it does have you know the presets and the environment and the models so we're all good there because i know some of them don't have an entire library but um yeah that's how you do it